this um, dam that is causing this menace in Nigeria is a Cameroonian dam that is called the uh, Legdo. It was built in 1977. Okay, and um, there is an agreement they had with Nigeria when they were building this dam that Nigeria is also going to build a, a counterpart dam um, that is called uh, Dasin Hausa Dam. Okay, mm. this dam we are supposed to be two and a half size of this uh, Lado dam that Cameroon is has yeah. built. Already. Yes, that Cameroon has built. Now, this dam that was supposed to be built by the Nigerian government, we are supposed to be the one and uh, uh, cushioning effect of dam, the one that of Cameroon, the one has. That Cameroon has. And now, this Cameroonian dam provides um, uh, irrigation to at least over close to 15 thousand you know irrig irrigation farm okay and these are uh, on them also supposed to provide irrigation to uh, you know states like kadamawa binue and all, all that. around that region all, yes yeah. and also provide 300 about 300 megawatts of electricity you know to that environment but you see nigerian government being a government that does not care about the life of the citizens refuse to complete this dam started and abandoned it and to this effect our people are being flooded you know when cameroon and in 2013 nigeria entered into another another agreement with cameroon mm. that at least before you open this dam because when there this is a was after flow, it was opened in 2012 yes, i think the first because, flood yes in 2013 they, 2013, had, a, they, had, yes, the they had an agreement and this agreement that is that when the dam cameroon dam is full and wants to release the excesses that they should inform nigerian government for me this is an irresponsibility as long as i'm concerned that a government chooses for Cameroonian government to inform them of when to open a dam and to prepare for for the for you know the consequences instead of building and completing a dam that they started since 1981 so it, it, it brings us to why we're asking this question